Hey everyone, thanks for joining me. Welcome to the monthly general oracle reading. This is for the month of October and November 2021. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, and Cross Watchers. Guiding energy for Capricorn, please. So I'm doing these in two month increments now. I don't want people to focus so much on the time frame. Take the messages that resonate with you. I know time frames are different for everybody. So these are always timeless. What does Capricorn need to hear, please? What is the guidance for the next few months? All right, Capricorn. So we have success and we have look for a sign. All right, so success. Success is yours. Things are going to work out just fine. But we also have look for a sign. So this may be a lot about timing. Looking for a sign. Pay attention to repeating numbers, words, things that people say, that kind of thing. Even at the bottom, we have get more information. So not everything may be revealed at this time. So your intuition, definitely you're going to need to pay attention to that and the guidance that you're getting from your guides and your ancestors. All right, so I'm going to pull one from the Halloween Oracle. What other guidance, please, for Capricorn? So if not all is clear or not all is revealed, it's likely a timing thing. Interesting, vampire, emotional intelligence. Um, all right, so this can represent the need to put up boundaries if necessary. Be careful who you let into your world. Some people can be vampires and not even be aware of it. Energy, energy vampires, they suck the life out of you, the negativity. So if you feel like you've had that around you or just, you know, energy that hasn't been good for you, you may need to set some boundaries. You may need to get clear on what is good for you and what isn't. This could be like a time of transition for you. Um, but again, some people are so unaware of the fact that they're so negative or draining. So be careful who you have around your home your workplace, um, you may want to do some like psychic protection, putting a bubble of protection around you and light. Now, I do want to point out at the bottom, I love this because you've got the success card and we have black cat. Fortune meets opportunity. So there's definitely some good fortune coming to you, Capricorn. We did have that success card, but you may be clearing certain things out of your, of your life, your path. Um, but just know that there is going to be a special opportunity that does come your way. It's probably just a timing thing right now. So everything has to be in alignment. And some of this may include, again, just like clearing energy that does not serve you. All right. So I'm going to pull one from Angels and Ancestors. If this resonates with you, definitely let me know. Leave a comment. Drop a heart. All right, so yeah, this is nice. And this really resonates with this. It's confirmation. Trust your talents in changing times. That's what I feel like. You're in a period of like transition for who this resonates with. And you may be clearing people out of your life or clearing energies. And some of this can even be your own energy and your own personal growth. But just know if things are changing, you need to trust your talents and the new path that you're going down. At the bottom, take time to reflect. Yeah, so I'm definitely seeing the links coming up here. I'm going to pull three from the Archangel Power Tarot. But trust yourself, have confidence, know how talented you are, and the success that you deserve, the good that you deserve. And you also deserve good people in your life who support you. So all in all, Capricorn, you definitely deserve better. All right, yeah, we have the death card. We have the wheel of fortune. So there's that confirmation for clear outs. Death, Scorpio energy, release the past. There's a more enriching future. Let go, let God. 
right? We have the wheel, new beginnings, end of delays, a change in direction that offers happiness. So there's that end in delays. And I do feel like you have been prone to having these delays happening, but it's because it's been a timing thing for you. And basically it's like the stars have had to align just right. So just know that. All right, so, wow, you have all major arcanas here. This is the one that I knew it was right for you. And look at this, new beginnings. Believe in yourself, listen to your heart, do what gives you joy, new beginnings, leap of faith. So yeah, that is coming up very strongly. Even look what's at the bottom. Another major arcana, the star, which represents Aquarius, a dream come true, believe in yourself, the end of a difficult situation. So yeah, definitely. Um, an end in delays, new beginnings, letting things go, anyone who is not good for you, or even just any energy within you that you know like needs to be transformed and cleared. So really nice energy overall. Success is coming and you deserve the best Capricorn. I hope you have an amazing month ahead or a few months ahead. If you're interested in any of my services or you want to follow me on Facebook or Instagram, all that information is included in the description box below. Take care.